this has been, we've been trying to do this for a long time and we, we wonderful Denise has been holding all of these little <laughs> ashes for since 2011 11 is the oldest. She's been holding yeah. on to these until we could have a space to call our home and to give them a final resting place on their own. So, um, so just um, we've all been talking about the rainbow bridge and we have a rainbow um, uh, wind chime now to come out here. So all of these animals, as they say, they go to the rainbow bridge. And so here's a little story about the rainbow bridge. There is a bridge connecting heaven and earth. It's called the Rainbow Bridge because of its many colors. Just this side of the Rainbow Bridge, there's a land of hills, meadows, and valleys with lush green grass. When a beloved pet dies, he goes to this place where there is food and water and warm spring weather. The old and frail animals are young again. Those who are maimed are made whole again. They play all day with each other. There's only one thing missing. <laughs> yeah, it's tough. I wasn't planning to do this. <laughs> no, I, yeah. They are not with their special person who loved them on earth. So each day they run and play until that day comes when one suddenly stops playing and looks up. The nose twitches, the ears are up, the eyes are staring, and this one suddenly runs from the group. You have been seen, and when you and your special friend meet, you take them in your arms and embrace. Your face is kissed again and again, and you let, look once more into the eyes of your trusting pet. Then you cross the rainbow bridge together, never again to be separated. Gosh, I'm sorry. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Golly. Yeah. No, but well, we all think about this with our own pets, and we get choked up. And so these animals here, as Denise had explained, you know, it always said, this, the, we were her, we were their families. They didn't have any families, nobody to shed a tear for them until us. So this is our way to pay respect to all those wonderful animals that have gone before us. <laughs> Golly, sorry. No, there's nothing wrong with that. Mm -hmm. that and you think, think about normal. your own, and then you think about these yeah. little guys. So they're all commemorated on this uh, memorial. All of their little names are engraved in the little tags. And if the wind blows, just so it it, it, it makes noise. So so that's those are all the little animals that we have kept their names and that have passed away for various reasons. And we have room for growth, but we hope we don't have to use those. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> so um, and so you see all of their little urns and boxes from over the years. And Sally was kind enough to bring pictures of Milo and Roger. Oh, that's that's for you. <laughs> Thank you so much for bringing them. <laughs> So we yeah. can see what Milo yeah. and Roger look yeah. like. And then we have we have holes dug already, pre dug holes, <laughs> that we're hoping to put two per hole and we can bury a little ball with them too. Uh -huh. So that they can each have a little ball to go into their hole with. So um, I'm gonna read off all the names so we can think, you know, you might recognize the names, you may not. But um, say a little prayer for each of them. Many there are 49, 49. And these are in alphabetical order. This isn't the order of you know, time or anything. We have Annie, Banjo, Belle, Big Boy, Birdie, Blossom, Buddy, Carswell, China, Dixie, Elliot, Finnick, Fiona, Fletch, Flora, Gabriel, Gracie's baby, Greta, Gretel, Hope, Julius, Lennox, Kitty, Milo, Misha, Missy, Moses, Precious, Ragley, Red Dog, Reese, Rockwell, Roger, Rudy, Samantha, 
Sassy, Satin, Tallulah, Tammy, Tango, Thistle, Tomato, Tonto, Topaz, Twilight, Venus, Wallace, Wally, and Winnie. So this is cats and dogs. So if you didn't hear some that you remember, they might have been a cat once once if you were a dog person. But anyways, they're all on the memorial. So. Thank you for doing this. Oh, well, it's, I think it was, we needed to yeah. commemorate them. Yep. So. Are the cats a different color? No, no, no. They're, they're all the same. It would be too much to grab. I thought about making little hearts for the cats. No, that's okay. No, this is wonderful. Yeah, that's they're really all nice. the same. That's so cool. Because they're all loved just the same. Yes. Yep. Definitely. Exactly. Right. Exactly. Well, this is lovely. So. so thank you very much for coming. And if you'd like to take an urn or at, you know, what a couple of them and bury them, we're going to put two per, per um, hole that we got. We're going to bury And then I bought, uh, I got these little seeds, or forget-me-not seeds. And after we cover the holes, then we're going to sprinkle these on here. And, and we'll see if little flowers come up. Yep. Where are they buried? So do we bury the up there? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Putting the whole thing. Yes. Oh. Yes. So y'all can, you know, if you want to take a couple. And so if two want to go together, yeah. We can do Lennox together. You might need to, for the bigger boxes, there are some holes that are bigger than others. So make sure you find a bigger hole for the They're not. We just the put them out. Yeah. Would you like Milo and Karen? Did you get Rogers? No, I've got Amisha and Parker. Wallace is. <laughs> if you'll take over videotaping, I'll uh I'll expand it. Here we go. That one's good. Right, so. <laughs> this makes me sad. <laughs> Are we putting our cards in with Yeah. Them? They're gonna fit. How about this one? Okay. Why should Oh, I have a. Oh, I had. I had put. We're gonna keep turning sides. Here's a bigger hold out here, ladies. Okay. That one bigger. Here's a bigger hold out here. Okay. 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 Here's a bigger hold out here. Roger. Oh, do we need the cards? Yeah. yeah. I mean, is that okay? Yeah. That's okay. That's fine. Put the cards in. It doesn't just go with this. It's fine. Oh, these means. Here are the seeds. Sprig, I've 